Welcome back to ZN Ranch, guys. Uh, Thanksgiving weekend. Haven't worked on the 46 just yet, but we worked on the bomber, the old farm truck. Uh, we replaced the factory hitch. Um, one of the reasons was this hole is elongated. Made the receiver in here rattle real bad. The other reason was because of these weights. Um, the new weights are significantly higher than these. And so uh, I got a Kurt. I will leave a, a description at the bottom of the part number for my pickup. Uh, if you have a uh, 01 through 0, uh, an 01 through 10 uh, GMC or Chevrolet, uh, it will fit. Uh, time with uh, uh, two young boys to help lift that up because the, the new hitch is 65 pounds. That one was significantly light, but uh, the new one was uh, quite a bit heavier. We'll go take a quick look at that. As you can see, it's, it's pretty high and tight. It's got some really big hooks here. You're not going to pull them off. Uh, the weight is uh, 162400. So, I mean, the, the weight just is, is, it's more than doubled the weight on this. So I have no fear. Um, uh, I also put in a new plug, a four pin, seven pin built in, ready to go. And the other thing I recommend, guys, get one of these quick testers. It, they just save you so much time. They just go right in, and it already shows you. See, I've got power. And if I had the lights on, it, it would be lighting up. We've already tested it. And uh, like I said, it does both this side and your four-way. And saves you a ton of time. If you're chasing electrical, this should be your first thing. Always check from the vehicle back. Because if you don't have power to this vehicle, you don't have power to the trailer. If you don't have power proper here, you know it's somewhere in your truck and you can start chasing it that way. So thanks for watching again, guys. Uh, tell your friends, subscribe, give things in the comments. We will uh, look at them if there's something that we've covered. If I'm wrong on something, let me know. But hey, thanks for watching. Have a great Thanksgiving. Uh, stay greasy, stay clean, stay safe.